Today we are headed over to Steamboat Springs, Colorado for the Hot Air Balloon Festival. It'll be about a two and a half hour drive, but it'll be worth it. So come join us. I'm Bill. I'm Kelly. And this is our This adventure. is our adventures. Oh. Here we go. going to go try to go to the base at Steamboat and look around up there. Well, we're here at the base. We're gonna go have a drink at Slopeside Grill and hopefully meet Tracy Riser. Y'all would have seen her in a previous. No, I think that was on my other channel. May need to post that one on this channel. It doesn't look as crowded as downtown was. Downtown was crazy, Fish Creek Falls is crazy. But we've totally changed our plans. We're not going to stay till tonight and see the balloons light up. We've done that a couple of years ago. We're just going to head on back. We're going to go here, then go to the barley, and then go back to our camper. I'm excited to see what this looks like without snow, as we've always seen it with snow. This looks dead. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs>
find a picture to show you what this looks like when there's snow. It's a shortcut, not a detour. Shortcut. I know where I'm going. I'm not lost. We'll see. I hear banjos playing. And which dirt road do we choose? Still not. of it and we had an amazing time went down to the city it was just too busy because of the bloom festival they had that morning then we tried to go to fish creek falls and walk up there it was packed we decided to go to the base of the mountain where you ski down to it was not busy at all it was such it was really nice to meet tracy and see her again She's a ski instructor that helps us every year when we go skiing. We got to go to the top of the mountain, see what it looks like without snow. And now we're headed, we're going to grab a pizza and go to bed because we have to head out tomorrow to head to Colorado Springs. The incline is coming. 